Okay, this is for uh, Fierce Turtle, Frank, Vern, and whoever the hell else wants to see. Um, sorry about the profanity. I curse a lot. Right, Amy? Yes. Curses. Okay. She's the girl with the little, uh, little, uh, little, uh, uh, little, uh, um, what do you call it there? Uh, a uh, little, a uh, little butt. That's what she has. She has a little butt. She's demure and tiny. Yep. Yeah. There's no sarcasm in my voice. Bullshit. Get in tight. Um, okay. Anyway, we're here at uh, the house, and yeah, see, yeah. things. No, oh, look at Kitty. Our house is kind of a an eclectic place. TV still not put together, but anyway. Um, ooh, look, art on the walls. And, oh, that's, can't see that. Anyway, um, there's the problem. Uh, as we can see, we have the exact same tester put on. You are correct. It is put onto the 20 or the 200 here, which even though it's kind of fuzzy in the image. Um, and I took a fuel injector. This is from a Thunderbird, but not the point. Um, they're essentially exactly the same. All the Bosch Type 1 and Type 2 filters. Or, or, I mean, uh, fuel injectors are basically the same. Um, not really much difference. Now, hopefully I can do this without having much problem. You take your two. Count them. I'm doing this with uh, one set of hands here. And you connect. Beep, look at that. Watch the numbers go down. Do, 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 do. They stabilized at... For what we're doing, we're going to say, ooh, look, see, it's still going down. And just a little tiny movement, and they'll change. So, we're talking, you know, eh, not too much of a difference, point, uh, point 0.3 or point, uh, or point 0.2 or 0.3. Okay, now, to do this, we're going to take this fuel injector like this and pretend that it's in the car. You then have two, count them, two little terminals in there. And you just, boop, you to use your little probes, and you find out what the resistance value is. Now I'm going to try and do this with just... Hey, I wonder if I can get uh, Amy over there to help hold the uh, camera while I do this. Would that be helpful? Okay, hi! No shooting your own boobies. This is a, this is a, ah, it's a family-oriented site and shit with the families and stuff. You don't want to get, uh, okay, we go like this. And now this is a low-impedance injector, most likely, so my numbers will be different. Look, at, look down on the uh, down on the little scanner thingy. Can it's we see the light. numbers? It's all white. Well, that's just because of the angle. There we go. It's still all white. I can't read it. We'll go from straight up. There you go. Now watch. Now this is a low impedance injector, so the numbers are going to be very, very low. On a single overhead cam, they'll be around about 12.7 is what it's supposed to be, although it'll actually be like about, uh, should be about 13.1 approximately, or 13-ish with yours, providing you have the same value in the scanner or the multimeter as I do. So this one minus the 0.5 is a 2.1 injector. I hope that, uh, you know, that explains basically what you're supposed to do. Um, this one came up to 5, which is perfectly fine. Um, and then you subtract that point, uh, 0.4 that I had earlier and end up with the correct amount. Anything else you want to know about fuel injectors, just let me know. Peace out, bitches.